receiver Princess Larissa's block. Today, um, I went to the post office. They stole the, uh, another informed delivery mail. They returned. They put mail in there from October 5. Um, they're stealing my mail. And it said unclaimed, and they crossed it out. So they're fucking, fucking with me at the post office. Medford, Southampton, Mount Laurel. They're fucking with me. Um, and I don't feel good. I wasn't thinking straight, so I didn't get everything I needed at the store, but I got some things. I get back... I figure I'll let the cleaner, you know, clean the room. Um, and they threw out my stuff just like they did at Days In. The, you know, creamer and coffees and stuff. They did that. That's fucked up. Then I go to do my wash because I don't even remember when the last time I did it. I mean, that's how fucking horrible I feel and I need to fucking wash my clothes. So I figure I'll do that. And I ask Stephanie in the office and then, lo, lo and behold, there they are. And the fucking woman saying, sorry, sorry. I already knew, but I don't even care. I give it to God. Like, if they're fucking taking advantage of me and stealing from me, it's on them. Okay, so then I fucking go to dry my stuff and she keeps saying, you sure you don't want to dry your stuff? Sorry, sorry. She fucking went, ran over there to do her stuff. I saw them getting changed and shit walking by me when I was at the clean, the guy was cleaning my room. So somebody stole four bounce sheets from me, four dryer sheets. Okay, they stole more than that. I had the whole fucking thing was full. That means they stole all my motherfucking dryer sheets. So how motherfucking fucked up you gotta be to do that i'll tell you how they're fucked up they're gaslighting fucking abuser lowlifes okay to do that to me and i'm by myself and trust and believe god is on my side and my son's side okay because they are fucking bad mouthing me to my son slandering my name um and taking advantage of me and i'm all by myself and you know what it says in the bible about the brokenhearted and those by themselves um and you know what they're doing they're taking advantage of me they bad mouth me to my son they slander my name to my son they were using a knife or a lie chart um and she knew they stole it. That's how fucked up they are. Okay? They're like my ex. That's what I equate them to. They're just like my ex. Um, said he was real not, you know, would never hurt me, blah, blah, blah. And he doesn't lie to anybody, but other people, he would lie to other people. And he did. He fucking hurt me. Then Bodie, that fucking lying sack of shit, says, you know, he would never hurt me and never lie to me, but he mistreats everybody. I don't remember. Fucking he's a liar. And then he fucking is an asshole to me. So I haven't dated because... I'm not fucking settling for some guy that may or may not treat me right. I am making damn sure that that guy is a guy God wants me to be with. 13 years, okay? And all they've done is fucking... This, this today is a fucking perfect example of gaslighting, okay? They're looking at me. They think I look okay. And he's still fucking dry. Who the fuck does that? They could have taken their time to done something. I can't even talk because I'm so fucking upset. I mean, this is fucked up. My fucking kidneys are fucked up. And they think because they look at me that there's nothing wrong. Well, I, I just say to them, since they like bad-mouthing me to my son, signing my name, hey, fucking feel how I feel for a day. Just a day. And then fucking check back with me and tell me if you motherfucking believe me. Because I can guarantee you guys would be in a fucking hospital crying, wailing, in pain. But I have a high tolerance of pain because 94 fuck-ups. And then I go to the ER in January and they fucking blow me off. I went... October 2018, that fucking black bitch lied in my chart, okay? They're making fun of me. I knew they were. They're making fun of me like I'm using a cane for no reason. Why the fuck, when I know people are making fun of me, would I walk around with a fucking cane knowing they're making fun of me doing that? Why would I do that? Okay, it doesn't make any sense. Why would I exaggerate? My fucking pain management doctor said I was his only patient that under-medicated. His only one. He knew I was in a lot of pain. They could tell when I was faking uh, being okay that I faked being okay. I don't fake being bad. I fake being okay. And they knew it. Every time I went, I fucking never could get it by them. They always knew I was fucking really de 